it's Ms. Lokonto. Got another story for you. This is a very special story called The Tiger Child. So it takes place, it's a folk tale from India. So you can imagine we're going on a trip to India to visit the tiger child. Let's see. So the tiger child, retold and illustrated by Joanna Trofton. Long ago, the tiger used to cook his food. One day, his fire went out. So the tiger had to go to the village to fetch some more fire. Hmm. The people were frightened when they saw the tiger coming. They locked their doors and bolted their windows. The tiger went back to the jungle. He visited his sister. She had a small tiger cub. Go to the village and fetch me some fire, said the tiger to his nephew. You are so small, the people won't be afraid of you. The tiger child started off, but on his way he played with the monkeys, splashed in the pools, climbed up trees. By the time he reached the village, he had forgotten what his uncle wanted. Can you remember? I have come for the thing my uncle wants, said the tiger child, but I can't remember what it is. Is it a bowl of fresh milk? The grandmother asked. The tiger child drank the bowl of fresh milk. Mm. When it was all gone, he said, no, I don't think that was it. I have come for the thing my uncle wants, said the tiger child but I can't remember what it is. Is it a delicious fish? The young boy asked. The tiger child ate up all the delicious fish. No, I don't think it was that, he said. I have come for the thing my uncle wants, said the tiger child, but I can't remember what it is. Is it a soft cushion? the little girl asked. The tiger child lay on the soft cushion. No, I don't think it was that, he said. I have come for the thing my uncle wants, said the tiger child, but I can't remember what it is. Is it a fine comb for his hair? the mother asked. The mother combed the fur of the tiger child. No, I don't think it was that, he said. The tiger waited all day for his nephew. When the sun set and the stars came out, he went to the village. The tiger child was tired. He found a house with a warm fire and fell asleep. The tiger looked in at the window where the tiger child slept. You have drunk the fresh milk. You have eaten the delicious fish. You have lain on the soft cushion. You have been combed with the fine comb. You are asleep by the warm fire. Tiger child, you are not a tiger anymore. You are a The cat woke up. He remembered what his uncle wanted. It was some fire. Yes, that was it. Then he yawned and went back to sleep. The tiger returned to the jungle. From that time on, tigers have had no fire. They eat their food raw. The tiger child, who turned into a cat, stayed in the village, and cats have lived with people ever since. That's the end.
Oh, that's a special story. I hope you enjoyed it. Good night.